Hello, hello guys, it is Brick Moto, and today we are back with another minifigure review. Today we have issue 95, Obi-Wan Kenobi from episode 2. Um, but yeah, this figure looks really good. We've had it with the um, Obi-Wan Starship before, but I'll show you that in a second. But uh, yeah, let's get into the minifigure. So on the packaging, we see the enlarged Obi-Wan Kenobi on the right, and then him in front of the yellow background on the left. This is kind of interesting, because on the back it doesn't show the weapon, it actually shows an alternative um, head, which is really cool, and completely different to what they used to do in the past. But let's rip it open and get the parts. Okay. There we go, all the parts are there, let's build the minifigure. Okay, so we start off with the legs, and we put the, the torso on. There we go. And then we put the headpiece on, put on his hood, finally the lightsaber. And there we go, let's have a look at the minifigure. So here we have the Obi-Wan Kenobi from episode 2, it looks really cool. Uh, obviously the print on the top, it goes through all the way from the waist, and also the pants as well, dual molded legs, which is really, really cool. Um, the hood also goes with it as well. Uh, it's got printing on the back, um, he has two different head, uh, head prints, so if we remove the hood, there we go, we can see him wearing the headset, and this uh, figure actually comes with... Uh, extra hair mold as well, which is really cool. And if you feel like you've seen this minifigure before, it's because you have. Because in Obi-Wan Starship, you also get the same minifigure. Um, I'll put them side to side real quick. But there we go, literally the exact same minifigure, except one comes with a Starship and is uh, it's a bit more expensive. And that is not to be confused with the other uh, Obi-Wan Kenobi minifigure that came with the magazine in the past. Uh, obviously it's a different design. So guys, that was a review of Obi-Wan Kenobi minifigure from episode 2. Uh, obviously this came out in the May edition of the magazine. Let me know if you managed to get your hands on one. It's currently in all shops. Um, make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.